Well, it is hockey night in okay. West Michigan. The defending Calder Cup champion, Grand Rapids Griffins, hoping to even their series with the Texas Stars at two games apiece. That's right. 24 News 8's Larry Fergurski will be calling the game tonight on the Griffins Radio Network, and he joins us now live from Van Andel Arena. And Larry, a very pivotal game in the series tonight. Yeah, it really is. You know, no one game in a series means more, obviously, than any other. But Game 4 tends to be pivotal in the sense that, unless it's a sweep, it's a series that is either 2-2 or 3-1. And in the Griffins' case, should they lose down 3-1, needing to win three in a row with two, of course, on the road. So big game in that sense. And Jeff Blaschel joining us now live, a guy who I promise you isn't worried about Game 5, let alone 6 or 7. Uh, and just talk about having to do that and just focus on what is here tonight. Well, yeah, as we spoke last night, it's a singular focus to win the hockey game tonight. I think momentum's a big thing, not just within games. It certainly is, but also within series, and we were able to seize a little bit of momentum last night. We want to keep the momentum on our side here tonight, so we're going to need a real good effort to do that. Uh, got a little chippy at the end of the game last night, and Jordan Tutu's in today. I mean, they may just be totally coincidence, but the thoughts on having Toots back in the lineup? Well, I think Toots is a real good hockey player. Brings a, a lot of good elements, some speed, some physical element. Now, we had to take a physical element in Grant out, um, but it really had nothing to do with the chippiness at the end. He's, he was cleared last night after the game, and we just felt like he was the right thing to do to put him in. How happy with, were you with the things you wanted to do. I mean, you slowed them down a bit, but obviously they had a lot of opportunities still in Game 3. You know, how, how successful were you in implementing what you wanted to do in Game 3? We're going to need to be better. We know we're going to need to be better. We felt like we did some good things. We were better for stretches of the game, especially the middle 30 minutes of the game or so. I thought we were much better, but we're going to have to be even better than that tonight for 60 minutes in order to win. And Martin Furk back in the lineup as well tonight, right? Yeah, we, you know, we think Furk has put himself in a position to be successful. He looked great in practice Monday. Hopefully he can come out and have an A game. We think he's made great strides. All right, hey, thanks for doing this. It's always so close to game time and a good luck tonight. Thanks, Larry. And it's Jeff Blash joining us live here. Van Andel Arena again. Game time 7.05. Guys, we'll have much more coming up in sports at 6.20. For now, live in Grand Rapids, Larry Figurski, 24-hour DC. Pretty awesome. Thanks, Larry. Game 4 is tonight at 7 at Van Andel Arena. Then you can catch Game 5 Friday night. Both games start at 7 o'clock.